that's uh that's fair. I don't know. I mean, I talked about it earlier, but Barking Frog said he wants to main Kazia, Steve, and Aegis uh, to make people feel bad. Which of course is a shame, because he's such a nice individual. Does. Of course he does. Of course he always does. the nice people that play the most demonic. It's always for the same reason. Like, we're already playing Smash Ultimate, man. That's not enough for you. You gotta take it one step further. Really? It's true. Right. It's hey, disrespect. man. Disrespect. Who, am I, who am I to judge, you know? We all we all play who we love. We all have our reasons. We're playing our favorite competitive children's party game. You know what it is. We we knew what we signed up for. Name tags coming through. Uh, I assume we're gonna see Wario. Oh, it depends on if Matador feels like playing Wario. He plays a lot of different wacky characters. So any I'm. Mario, Luigi, Doc. He Mario. plays like a Mario cast. He plays Falcon. He's played Cloud before. Uh, See about Jeff saying something in the distance. Seagull Joe adjusting the AC <laughs> of a place you that? he doesn't really run or own. He just decided to I'm change not. the settings in a you venue. pay for that? <laughs> the power move of this man to just decide that. So we had that this whole time and no one turned it on? Dog, I'm sweating. Oh. It's been on. So it's we worthless. Have, we gotcha. have sources saying gotcha. it's even been worse. on. Even better. Even better. Uh, but just the power move on that man to just walk around the venue and decide to change settings in a place he doesn't run. Hey. It's par for a reason, you know. It's uncomfortable. It's the top player mentality. Okay, we're going, we're playing it straight here. A Warrior Palatina versus Mr. Grammar on Lucina and Electrode on Bowser. Alright. Not the Zelda coming in from Mr. Electrode, not the Sephiroth. Yeah, he has, he has been putting a lot of work in Bowser lately. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen him using him in Bracket occasionally. Yeah, that's the, I think, certified secondary. I've played it before in Bracket when the Zelda didn't really work out, so it makes sense. But right now, they're just getting juggled, because that's kind of what yeah, these right characters now, do. Oh my this. god, mo, oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, man. <laughs> a little bit of ping pong right now. They are, yeah, they are, they were still, they were still in the stage for a while there. I mean, you can see in the chemistry room, he two people team, like, they immediately know the setup. Like, we're immediately just going to go for the juggles. I mean, they're already in triple digit percent. Ooh. That makes a big difference. Had the regular Agadir with that force smash just missed space of light a little bit. Ooh, missed the tech there. Kind of a dubious situation. Yeah, single joke cleaning it. Both of them dying at the same talk from the respective players. Chemistry, synergy. They're, they're, <laughs> even the 1v1s are synergized. That's a, it's, it's giving easy. duo. Like, <laughs> this is a real, real nice play right now. True. And now, single joke having to recover. And Ooh. it's just a raw up smash coming in from Electro to take that stock. Oh man. A lot of shield pressure going on from both parties. Ooh, a lot of them are missing the half off. That, off. <laughs> that was yeah. a shield pose, like my good. Yeah, I saw it. I was like, eh, that's cool. The double smash attack to really chip away that shield. Oh, Ooh, yeah, and you're getting aggressive, you're gonna get swatted away. Meanwhile, a single just playing a little bit of footsies with Samurai Nick in the center stage. Yeah, I feel that Samurai, the way he's positioned for a while there, he was putting himself in the corner so that Seagull can both play footsies with him and just immediately disengage to help Matador when he needed to. Like, that was like the situation for like a real long amount of time in that second stock. Meanwhile, yeah, just a lot of raw smash attacks coming in, and that's the quick handoff from, a, my goodness, Electro died at like 95 as Bowser. Immediately takes Samurai next stock, so he needs yeah. to keep himself in the fight. Doesn't want to make him 1v1. Right now, Seagull Joe doing a really nice job stock taking here. Samurai Nick unable to find that forward air off the ledge. Just keeping dominant control of the game. Even though they're up so much, they don't really think about giving an inch. They don't think about overextending too much. Like, they just play the game as tight as they possibly can. Wow, That's going to be that another was, stock from another Palatina That was a really nice string that they had there, and you're dead. Oh, ooh, two not him. Mm. Mm -hmm. That stanky on. Seal Joe didn't even lose his stock there. My man's smiling. My man's smirking. He knows what he did. He knows what he did. Absolutely. Even, oh yeah, goodness. Matador's also smiling. Just disrespectful play. I mean, it's not even disrespect. It's like, they just know what they're it, doing. It's clean cut. Precision. Better player moment. Better sort of players player. moment. And yeah, better players. And that's just part of the course. Again, these are two PR players teaming for the event. Very experienced Being like, players. yeah, we're just going to run it. Although, I actually don't know where Seagull Joe is on the latest PR. It might be possible that Krishan is the highest placing MDVA PR player in attendance, which is very funny. Uh, I think he is... Yeah, yeah he's like so. between 10 and 15 or something. Matador's also in that, I think, in the back Yeah, half they're in the lower as well. And okay, yeah, see, so we're going to the Marth instead of the Lucina, we're going to the Zelda instead of the Bowser. Yep. 
makes a little bit of sense. I mean, you want to try to make something. Maybe you didn't find the characters for the solution. I mean, Electro got back aired off stage and died at very yeah, low percent. There are so many times where like Electro got hit and then it was immediately at 120. Like they were just so they're just so aware of Bowser's disadvantage state. Exactly. And Loki, I don't think Zelda's disadvantage state is much better. It can be a little bit iffy depending on how you approach the issue. And if they're aware of that, uh, Nair's love like that has a lot of punishable frames. Oh, oh, wow. just, what a kerfuffle going in. But hey, it's All a sock right. trade, really. All right, yeah, that's, yeah, I think Electro just used his up B in that situation. I don't know if um, Samurott's Marth's up B got Matador in any way, but I do know that Electro just let that up B fly. Mm -hmm. Ooh, just the raw Ectol center stage. Not going to kill Electro, of course. And now Samurai Neck just stuck in the trenches. He yeah, that's the thing. Terrible you're getting pressured. Spot to be in, yeah. You can't roll in because Warrior's yeah. still gonna hit you. You gotta be careful around that Palatina. It's a pretty scary situation. Yeah, being sandwiched in doubles is definitely not a situation you ever want to be in. And it's like the just like the first game, Siegel is doing a very nice job holding his stocks. Yeah, I mean he's barely been touched. Look at that, 61% on Man. his first stock. And like another situation where like you just got Matador just had them they had them both in the corner. It's just not a lot of not a lot of options for them right now. Ooh, just the aggression coming up from the left side. Meanwhile, Seal just trying to tap it in, keep that list trap going. He didn't really let it happen and now he has to kind of catch up. Very nice. I like that up B there by Electro. The um, Seagull Joe, like obviously he wasn't really predicting that. Uh, Electro took advantage of that, like the little mix up. Now the situation where just they are they're holding center stage so concretely that Ooh. and Samurai Nick dies there that it's just they just have to kind of tap it in on Electro. He's trying to do it <laughs> off the top with that hitbox, but no, the nearest love coming out. Uh, so if I find the follow-up, no, there it the is. Bear, so, no. Not that gonna take care of it. We do. Okay. Okay, boys. <laughs> Let's see how it is. That's some Electro not going. Oh they're both just up smashing at random points on the go? stage. I like the bravery from Electro to just try to get a kill at zero. Yeah, yeah. now you're you are dead unless you get the you attack. Got a yes, he Ooh, does. But he misses it barely. That's unfortunate. You can see that like that was actually really good. Couldn't quite find the distance to get back to the legend. I honestly just think he upper air dodge. Like let's look at this. Let's look at this. So it goes down. He falls. It looks like he he did a tech jump and then air dodge. Uh, he didn't go for the upbeat. Unfortunate. I hate to see unfortunate. it. Unfortunate. One more time for the fans. Tech jump Pop. into the bumpy air dodge. PS2 is a good stage, everybody. It's still a good, hey, still a good stage. I don't agree with that. 